Mercedes Yossa Flux Motor, the secret powerhouse that's shaking the EV world. When everyone thought the idea was still years away, Mercedes did something that caught the entire automotive world off guard. It officially announced that its long-whispered Yussa Flux motor has not only moved beyond the prototype stage, it's real, tested, and ready for production. What was once considered science fiction is now roaring into reality. For years, this motor existed only in rumors and patent papers, a pipe dream of engineering so advanced that many believed it couldn't be brought into the real world for another two decades. But now, Mercedes has declared to the world, it's here. This is more than a technical milestone. It's a disruption, a paradigm shift that threatens to rewrite everything we thought we knew about electric vehicles, EVs. Why is this such a big deal? Because the Yossa Flux motor isn't just another powertrain. It's an evolutionary leap. We're talking about a motor that is lighter, more compact, more efficient, and more powerful than anything else on the market. And the implications are immense. Lighter cars mean less strain on batteries, longer ranges, quicker acceleration, and ultimately, cheaper and better EVs. It's no exaggeration to say that this could render existing EV motor technology obsolete. But before we break down why Tesla, BYD, and others might be in serious trouble, let's first understand what exactly this flux motor is, where it came from, and why Mercedes kept it hidden for so long. The Silent Revolution, how Mercedes kept its masterstroke secret. In 2021, Mercedes quietly acquired a small but brilliant British company named Yassa. To most, this seemed like just another routine business acquisition. But to those in the know, this was Mercedes making a chess move 10 steps ahead of everyone else. Yassa had spent years researching a type of motor called the axial flux motor, a radical departure from the radial motors used by virtually every EV manufacturer, including Tesla. While traditional radial motors operate like spinning wheels, axial flux motors function more like spinning fans. This configuration allows for a significantly higher power-to-weight ratio, greater efficiency, and vastly reduced heat generation. The axial flux design means magnetic fields travel across a shorter path, making energy transfer dramatically more efficient. That translates to motors that are smaller, cooler, and pack an incredible punch. Yasa had working prototypes, but lacked the financial muscle to bring them to scale. That's where Mercedes stepped in, not just with capital, but with commitment. The company gave Yasa full freedom, telling its engineers, take the time you need, but deliver something world-changing. And they did. Behind the scenes, testing was rigorous and relentless. Failures were met with iteration, setbacks with solutions. All this was happening while Mercedes played its cards close to the chest. Not even its dealership network was aware of what was brewing. Then came 2024. Mercedes stepped forward and said, The flux motor is ready. Flux versus radial. The tech that changes everything. So what makes the Yossa flux motor so revolutionary? First, weight. Where a traditional EV motor might weigh around 100 kilograms, the Yossa flux motor achieves the same, or better, performance at just 30 to 40 kilograms. That's a 60 to 70 percent weight reduction. Second, energy efficiency. Traditional radial motors convert roughly 89 to 93 percent of energy into motion, with the rest lost as heat. The Yossa flux motor, thanks to its axial configuration, operates at an astounding 96 to 97 percent efficiency. Less energy lost means better battery life, longer range, and improved overall performance. Third, power density. The Yossa motor delivers nearly double the power in the same size envelope. For high-performance applications like Mercedes AMG models, this means blistering acceleration without sacrificing drive range or requiring bulkier components. And let's not forget the cost. Because flux motors are simpler to manufacture and don't require extensive cooling systems or heavy materials, they promise long-term reductions in production costs. Mercedes didn't just adopt this motor, they optimized it. YASA's breakthroughs in magnetic design and coil winding meant even more compactness and even more power. This is why the flux motor is headed first to the AMG series, where luxury meets raw speed. Just imagine, a motor so compact that two people can lift it, 
yet capable of pushing a luxury sedan from 0 to 100 km per hour in under 4 seconds. That's not just evolution, that's revolution. The threat to Tesla, BYD, and the status quo. Until now, Tesla's motors were the gold standard. Efficient, powerful, and years ahead of the competition. BYD, meanwhile, found its niche with reliable, affordable EVs using cost-effective technology. But both rely on radial flow motor technology. And now they may be on the verge of being leapfrogged. Let's start with Tesla. Its motors are powerful, but big, complex, and prone to thermal inefficiency at sustained high performance. In contrast, the Yusa Flux motor offers similar, or superior, output in a package half the size and weight, with superior thermal characteristics. That's a direct hit to Tesla's performance and cost model. And BYD, its main advantage has always been price. But what happens when Mercedes, thanks to simpler manufacturing of the Flux motor, can offer not only a cheaper motor, but one that delivers more range, performance, and reliability. If Mercedes applies this tech to its mass-market EVs, BYD will find itself in a price-performance war it may not win. The truth is, the Yusa Flux motor represents a trifecta that no EV maker has yet achieved. Maximum power, maximum efficiency, and minimum weight, all in one unit. It's the holy grail of EV propulsion. And now it's real. Proving ground, Mercedes' secret tests and breakthroughs. Mercedes didn't unveil this motor until it had tested it to the limit. Early lab tests were followed by real-world trials, starting with the EQS sedan. Engineers recorded a 70 kg weight drop and a 12% increase in range. The real fireworks happened in the AMG series, where the flux motor cut the 0 to 100 km per hour time by 0.7 seconds without overloading the battery. A 24-hour endurance test on a private track showed that the flux motor maintained consistent power output with minimal heat buildup, a feat no radial motor can match. Mercedes even ran it in SUVs, which demand higher torque. The motor handled it effortlessly. Why it matters. A new era for electric mobility. The implications go far beyond Mercedes. If this technology scales, and it will, it could redefine what EVs look like, feel like, and cost. More space for interiors. More range with smaller batteries. Faster charging. Lighter footprints. Lower production costs. In other words, a genuine leap forward. Tesla, BYD, and the rest now face a choice. Either catch up or license the tech from Mercedes, if Mercedes even allows it. Either way, the balance of power has shifted. This isn't just a motor. It's a message. Mercedes has declared. The future of electric performance has arrived, and it weighs half as much, lasts twice as long, and runs cooler than anything else on the road. Let the new race begin. Imagine a colossal structure rising from the heart of the Texan desert, a place where the dry heat of the land clashes with the cold pulse of future innovation. At first glance, it may seem like nothing more than an oversized, rectangular building, another factory among many. But step closer, and you'll witness something truly transformative. This is not merely a manufacturing plot. This is Tesla's Giga Texas, Elon Musk's boldest industrial masterpiece, and what's happening inside is rewriting the very code of modern manufacturing. A place that stands amid the sand and sun but shapes the speed of global progress. In this architectural behemoth, Reality feels suspended between now and next. Yes, this is the domain where Cybertrucks are forged and Model YS emerge every 40 seconds, a tempo unheard of in traditional automotive plots. But the cars are only the tip of the innovation iceberg. Within these walls, hundreds of AI-powered robots operate with unwavering precision, lifting, welding, assembling, and learning. Tireless and unfazed by time. These mechanical titans work in symphony, guided by sensors and algorithms that make autonomous decisions in real time. The heart of the operation, a technological marvel known as the Gigapress, a machine so powerful it could compress the weight of 2,000 elephants in a single blow. Where once dozens of parts needed meticulous welding to form a car's chassis, now a single, awe-inspiring press molds the vehicle's backbone in one seamless movement. Time slashed. Strength enhanced, 
error minimized. This isn't just efficiency, it's evolution. And it doesn't stop there. Tesla's AI arms, more like agile serpents than rigid tools, dance across assembly lines with grace and speed that dwarfs human reflexes. They paint. They rivet. They adjust. They learn. Every mistake corrected. Every success stored. Inside this self-regulating factory, time itself has been bent. There are no shifts, no bells, no lunch breaks. The system never sleeps. Software monitors every bolt, every torque measurement, and every micrometer of deviation. The moment something seems amiss, an alert is triggered, and a backup plan is set in motion, automatically. Human work has remained, but more as conductors than laborious, analyzing data, ensuring finesse, guiding the evolution of machines that may one day outgrow even our oversight. Even the delivery bots inside, AGVs, or automated guided vehicles, move with eerie intelligence. Unmanned, they glide through paths they know by memory, pausing, turning, rerouting when necessary. These AGVs are not just carriers. They are the vascular system of Gigatexes, ensuring parts flow seamlessly through the veins of this mechanical giant. And if you thought this was just about one or two car models, think again. This is where the Cybertruck, with its angular armor and sci-fi demeanor, begins its journey. Where the Tesla Semi prepares to redefine freight logistics with electric torque and machine learning routing. Where the fabled Model 2, the $10,000 to $15,000 compact electric car aimed at the global mass market, is being prepped to democratize electric mobility. Each of these innovations hinges on one crucial core, the 4,680 battery cell. This isn't a battery, it's a revolution in a cylinder. Bigger in form, denser in charge, faster to power up, and able to push vehicles further with fewer modules. A technology born not in a lab, but within this very factory. The factory itself is a proof of concept, a machine that builds machines. Not just any machines, but intelligent, scalable systems capable of rapid, precision-driven output. And just as smartphones once redefined communication, Tesla's Giga Texas aims to redefine what manufacturing can look like when it's unshackled from 20th century constraints. Elon Musk isn't merely building vehicles. He's building a future where the act of creation is faster, cleaner, smarter. So next time you see a Tesla glide silently down the road, remember, it wasn't born in a factory. It was born in a vision. A vision etched into the scorching earth of Texas breathing life through robotic limbs, and fueled by the ambition to outpace time itself. This is Giga Texas, not just the future of Tesla, but the blueprint for an entirely new industrial age. But the evolution of electric vehicles is not Tesla's story alone. In 2024, Mercedes-Benz entered the fray with a groundbreaking innovation of its own, the Yusuf Flux Motor. This revolutionary motor, rooted in axial flux technology, is redefining performance, efficiency, and cost metrics across the electric vehicle landscape. The technology proved itself in real-world tests. Vehicles became lighter. Pickup became smoother. Battery efficiency jumped. Mercedes showcased the EQS sedan, equipped with the flux motor, in a private media event where it sprinted from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 3.2 seconds, performance comparable to AMG petrol cars. In a side-by-side -side test, the flux-powered EQE outlasted its conventional counterpart by 50 kilometers. The message was clear. This was not just an experiment. It was the beginning of a production-ready transformation. For years, Tesla was synonymous with top-tier EV performance. BYD dominated with affordability. But Mercedes's new technology straddles both dimensions, power and practicality. The flux motor is lighter, more powerful, and offers extended range. It doesn't just compete with Tesla, it threatens to eclipse it. If Mercedes succeeds in bringing this motor into entry-level EVs, companies like BYD, Volkswagen, Hyundai, and Ford will be forced to catch up. The implications ripple far beyond luxury models. For customers, the impact is transformational. A lighter motor means less load on the battery, and that translates to longer range. 800 to even 1,000 kilometers could become the norm. Charging becomes faster. 
performance becomes smoother. Complaints about electric vehicles being sluggish or short-range will dissolve. And thanks to the motor's elegant design, large-scale production will drive costs down. By 2025, the first production flux motor cars, AMG versions of the EQE and EQS, will arrive in Europe and North America. From 2026 onwards, the motor will trickle into more affordable Mercedes models. By 2027 or 2028, countries like India may begin to see these vehicles on the road. Mercedes plans to transition all of its electric offerings to flux motor technology by 2030. And this won't be a Mercedes monopoly for long. Engineers across the globe, from Tesla to Hyundai, are racing to decode the motor's architecture and leapfrog the innovation. This fierce competition will accelerate technological upgrades across the board. The result? Cheaper, better, faster EVs for everyone. On the macro level, the global economy will shift. As EVs become more efficient, the demand for certain raw materials will decrease. Manufacturing costs will fall. Fossil fuel demand will drop further, aiding the environment and strengthening global green initiatives. Flux motor technology, therefore, doesn't just transform a car. It reshapes an entire ecosystem. In the coming years, we will witness a convergence of affordability, sustainability, and exhilarating performance. Mercedes Flux Motor isn't just a game changer. It's the catalyst for a new phase in the auto industry. A future where electric vehicles are not only viable but dominant. The question now is, who will rise to meet this new standard and who will fall behind? This is no longer a matter of company versus company. It is innovation versus stagnation. The race is on, and the road ahead is electric.